Hello guys, this is Jackie Rajput and welcome to my channel Creative Royale. We will learn video editing, graphic designing and some awesome cool stuff. So stay connected to me. If you like my video, please support me by liking this video and please don't forget to subscribe my channel. It will help a lot. Today we will learn about a crazy transformation effect. Yes, crazy, right? Let's have a look. Isn't it cool? Actually, this transformation effect is achieved by an inbuilt transition. Yes, right there in the Premiere Pro. The most important thing to achieve this transformation effect is the still background. Yes, background should be still. And surrounding objects should also be the still. You can use slider if you want a moving object video. Or you can simply click photos of the object using your smartphone or whatever camera you use. As I don't have a camera, so here I am using my smartphone to achieve this effect. Here I am putting my phone on a tripod and taking some cool photos of the object I want to transform. Here for reference, I am using some deodorant bottles which we will transform one into the other. First I am taking photo of first bottle and then I will put the second bottle at the exact same place. Background should also be the same. Now boom, shooting part is done. Now let's jump into the Premiere Pro. Create a new project and a new sequence as per your need. Here I am taking standard 1920 by 1080. Now add all photos in the Premiere Pro. In your case, you can add your video footage also. Now add all photos in timeline. Now go to effect panel. Go to video transitions and in the start transition folder find morph cut. Yes, morph cut is the key. Drag and drop this transition between two clips. Premiere Pro will now analyze the clips and between two clips it will add some more frames so it can achieve a liquify effect now it is analyzed let's render it and boom isn't it cool one more thing you can add is some movement by using position and scale keyframes so it will have a shot like a slider moving the most important use of this transition is in interview videos or YouTube videos like this. Let's have a look. If you want to hide your mistakes, so you have used jump cuts, but using these transitions, you can smooth out your jump cuts and it will look like you have never made a mistake. You can achieve this same effect in Final Cut Pro also. Yes, the effect named Flow Cut in the Final Cut Pro and also in DaVinci Resolve and it is smooth cut. So now no jump cuts more. Yes, this is crazy transformation effect you can use in your videos. It's freebie time. Yes, as this is my first video, I am giving you 8 free LUTs. Yes guys, free LUTs. Download the LUTs from the link below in the description and enjoy. We will meet here again with an awesome topic. Till then, do whatever you want to do, but be creative. If you find this video helpful, please don't forget to like this video and don't forget to hit the subscribe button below. So here I am signing off. Bye bye. See you.